elect Ross Baraka may tell Newarkers that they are all the mayor, but some of them are actually council members, and those council members will need to be on the same page with the new mayor if his ambitious agenda is to move forward. Securing two victories in last night's council runoff gave Baraka allies a 5-4 to four majority on the council. It was very important that we got the two victories yesterday because now we have the predominantly vote on the council. We need five votes in order to move the city forward. And uh, it was just important because of the morale purposes with the mayor. We just won an election on May 13th, and it was a mandate. Gail Chenefield Jenkins easily won her runoff election last night and returns to the city council after an eight-year absence, a solid Baraka supporter. A mayor and a council have to work together. They don't always have to agree, but they have to have open lines of communication in order to make things happen. We don't want to have gridlock happen like it is in Washington. One winner who was not on the ballot last night was incumbent Councilwoman Mildred Crump, who won her election in May. She's expected to be re-elected president when the council reorganizes on July 1. As such, she will set council agendas and often whip votes for the mayor she helped elect. Compared to the last mayor, this new mayor is going to be much more hands-on. Uh, yes, he is, but in a different kind of a way. Uh, there's a way to be hands-on when you're territorial, but there's also another way to be hands-on when it's cooperative. And so I'm looking forward to the new way of being um, a part of a hands-on government. A united front will be necessary going forward as the city tries to avoid a state takeover of its finances and struggles for more control of its schools. Although they met a few weeks ago, Baraka was not at an event in the city today where Governor Christie was in attendance. Can you tell us anything about your meeting with Mayor Baraka? Okay. I've said everything I want to say about that. In the city with so many important matters to address, Mayor-elect Baraka will need all the help he can get. Yesterday's victories were an important first step, but relations between Newark mayors and their council counterparts are notorious for starting strong and ending badly. So the new mayor will have to get things done quickly while he has the council. In Newark, I'm David Cruz, NJTV News.